option. So the two proposals are joint ticketing and the let, or the low carbon and one of the other two. So I would pr propose joint ticketing, so I think that's something we can really do some work on as a group. Councillor Brian was, was next. Yeah, thank you, Chair. Um, if we're only going to have two topics, I would want one of them to be uh, something to do with economic development. I feel that the ticketing one could be dealt with as a workshop, which I think has been suggested, rather than a task and finish group. That's my personal feeling. If we're only settling on two, I wouldn't mind if the ticketing was on if we were settling on three. a few workshops already on uh, the renewables and energy and um, low carbon so we will be getting feedback from those and the air quality so I don't, I, I don't see the value of that as we should know. Thank you. Councillor Brown, you were made about economic development. I think the LEP is fundamental to economic development. If everybody needs scrutiny and lacks current scrutiny, um, it, it's the LEP. So I'd be very unhappy at any exclusion of the LEP. <coughs> so the sticking with the LEP scru uh, scrutiny panel, that could um, that could incorporate economic development, so we should keep that. Yeah? Do you agree with that? I need to remind myself what the other two were. So, Chairman, if it assists, I think we've agreed to part of the Bus Services Act um, and the ticketing, um, and I think that leaves us with low carbon and um, the left, and I think that's the two we're settled on at the moment. It's quite hard to kind of distill this down. So it, there's a difference between having a workshop on them and doing a task and finish. It's a very different approach. So I think we need to bear in mind that whilst we've had a number of workshops, they were to try and inform whether you felt that they would could help to, uh, be subject to a task and finish group in the future. Um, and I'm just conscious that the 4th of September agenda is actually quite environment orientated in terms of feedback reports because you have the Year of the Environment, Mersey Tidal Power Project and Air Quality. So I don't know whether um, that will um, give comfort to members about the work that's been done in that area or whether that will just give you more determination that you want to do a, a scrutiny review. So perhaps if we can just reach a conclusion on, on one task and finish today that we can get kicking and rolling off and whether that's the left um, and then we revisit this subject again. I'm just trying to facilitate progress because I'm conscious if we lose calendar time um, and don't start any task and finish, we won't get three fitted into the year. So I am keen that we, um, the committee reaches a conclusion on at least one um, suggestion today so that that ball can start rolling if I, if I can be that bold. Thank you. Thank you. Uh, Councillor Wainwright? Yes, sir, I, I, I agree with what you say. There's enough coming through in, 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 in the meeting you've just suggested with, with regards to the environment and, and carbon. Let's see where that goes. If we feel that we need to be doing further scrutiny on that, we can slot it in maybe next year or, or late in this municipal year. But the left is an important one, and for the first time I'm agreeing 